From our digital team, a Georgia Southern graduate student played a big role in helping launch the first ever Black Birders Week. WSAB.com reporter Ashley Williams spoke with the scientist about the importance of diversity in STEM. As a black woman working in natural sciences, Corina Newsom has seen firsthand the lack of diversity in STEM. Wildlife sciences is one of the most homogeneous spaces that I've been in, uh, meaning that most people are white. I've encountered, I think, one other black person in my academic spaces. The Georgia Southern grad student says she's gotten used to it. Still, she says it's a breath of fresh air to meet other scientists of color. Over the past couple years, Newsom has connected online with several black people working in STEM. We have just been kind of a big, massive friend group of people in STEM, specifically, especially wildlife. Newsom studies and is passionate about birds. Birds are kind of my thing. They're my favorite group of animals. It's why the viral Central Park video from May especially shocked her. Bird watcher Christian Cooper recorded the racially charged incident involving a white woman. That's when Newsom's online group took action. Within probably 48 hours, hours, we had concocted an entire week of celebration of black people opening up dialogue about our experiences and encouraging and, and voicing the um, importance of diversity in all of our spaces. The virtual Black Birders Week was born. Newsom was blown away at the response. Other academic groups, other groups in STEM have started their own black in whatever weeks and have been able to celebrate blackness and the black experience and talk about the reason why having black people in these careers is so important. Ashley Williams, WSAV.com now.